Hello fellow simmers and welcome to this tutorial from Flight Sim Productions. Today we're going to cover a nasty little thing that can sometimes happen with Easy Dock Camera or EZCA as it's also known as. And that's uh, maybe you're having some issues getting your hat switch to work on your joystick. Now I know myself, I just had this issue, I searched the web and I found nothing. Nothing to help me out so I just kind of tinkered around, stumbled across this, and as always, I like to share things, and I thought I would share it with you guys and uh, see if it can help you out. Okay, so we're going to open up our latest version that we have, which is version 1.18.7, and that is available by doing a Google search, and it should take you to the uh, Flight One forum. You may have to type in EZCA and then type in the version. I went into the uh, configured joysticks and I selected my joystick from the drop down menu there where that little pointy arrow is there on the right next to the J1 and uh, didn't work. I clicked on the hat switches button, didn't work. I clicked on the joystick button on the uh, side and uh, it still didn't work. So, after getting frustrated, I thought, well, let's go into the folder itself. And you can go into the EasyDoc folder, which is stored on your C drive in Program Files 86, EZCA. And in that folder, you're going to find another folder that says SimConnect 10.0.61259.0 Installer. Within that folder is a file called SimConnect.msi. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to left double click on that. And it looks like it may or may not be doing anything. In my instance, when I left double clicked on it, it looked like it didn't do anything. But in all actuality, it did take care of my problem. So once that was going, I went back into the joystick configuration. And reselected my joystick. And I did not have to click on any of the other extra boxes there off to the right and uh, everything worked and I was able to move freely my hat switch and all was good hopefully this will help you out as always thank you so much for watching our videos we really greatly appreciate it throw us a thumbs up if you like what you see and as always don't forget to subscribe because it lets us know that what we're doing is what you want to see if you have any suggestions, please contact us in the forums or send us a private email through YouTube. And check us out on Facebook at facebook.com slash Flight Sim Productions.